never give anything a 10, but I'll give it a nine and a half. They treated the township fair. They treated me fair. Overall, I think just the transparency and communication style, um, I would say just kind of put it over the top. Everyone that came in, it was a handshake. It was, uh, you know, welcome. Amazing. I've never worked with more squared away people. The open lines of communication between the landowners and the contractors and Ameren all just fit together and helped the success of the project. The Spoon River project is one of several projects that we are doing across the Midwest to provide value to our customers. It is the first MVP project that we are completing to provide that value to our customers, which includes reliability. Reliability not only for today, but for the future improved efficiency on the system, and access to new power sources like wind. The Spoon River Transmission Project consists of two substations, Sandberg and then Fargo 345, and then a 44 mile, 345,000 volt transmission line to connect the two, which is about 1.4 million feet of transmission line, which would span the entire length of the Grand Canyon. To start, we engage them even in the town halls to gather information about routes, where things would be environmentally sensitive or historically sensitive, and that information was gathered and included in some of the route plans. Before the project got started, um, we were included by your planning team to come to the pre-planning meetings and mark on the aerial maps, you know, sensitive areas that we knew about in the county. It was great. Everyone that I have talked to was very satisfied. I even had one commissioner tell me his roads were better now than they were before Ameren came in. Sitting down at the table at the beginning of the project with the road commissioners really helped establish a level of trust with Ameren and with the contractors because they knew not only are they telling me, they're also telling the contractor at the same time. They listen to the communities, work together to identify the best project and the best way to put that project together and the best way to do it in the community so that they minimize the impact. Farmers' biggest concern is the compaction of their farm fields because that affects their livelihood. So this project employed the use of helicopters for the aerial line stringing. It has helped accelerate the schedule and it's helped with our relationship with the farmers and, and our impact on their land. Farmers look at it as when you're letting somebody on your farm, it's no different than letting someone in your house. Everybody got in, did their job, was very efficient. That was probably the most impressive thing that I saw was the efficiency of whether they're using local labor or you know coming together as a team, bringing in their own people. They were here to work and that's what they were doing. I've learned a long time ago, you can't stop progress. So Amron was good enough to help out the landowners to move it around, put extra corners in, extra money they had to pay just to get along with the people. We went through a, a lot of ins and outs, a lot of changes along the way, and everybody had to be agile and flexible, and I, and I do appreciate it as a project manager, and I think the end product in, was very indicative of that. To sum up the landowners in this project, they've been supportive and cooperative throughout and helped to the success of the project. One of our real estate agents got stuck down at the bottom of the hill, and the landowner loaned him a vehicle and then pulled him out the next day. I mean, it's that kind of support. It's, it's those kind of things that I see. So it's been a privilege. And the one thing we did great in this project was we listened and we listened up front and we made adjustments as we went through, which enabled us to build the project very efficiently. Well, so I'd like to say thank you to the whole team, the team that included our folks at Ameren, our contractors, the landowners, the community, and other stakeholders who collaborated together for us to provide this valuable project that will bring benefits to all of our communities and power the quality of life for years to come.